Today we're going to review Ruvac's flood vac. This flood vac is a compression cast composite vacuum. The vacuum housing is extremely durable. It's extremely bulletproof as well. So you can use this uh, back and forth on a job site without having to worry about breaking it. The nice thing about this is the vacuum motor is on the top. It's fully exposed. You can easily get at it to service it, but it also runs cool. So the vacuum motor is ex uh, extremely accessible if you do need to service it, and it does run longer and cooler. Motor switch on and off. You have a separate switch for the return pump. This is a 12 gallon unit. You'll notice that we do have a return pump cam lock system here. That's how you're going to discharge all the material. The intake for the vacuum is a machined aluminum intake. Notice that it's not mounted on the lid. It's mounted permanently on the housing. So when you go to connect your hose, you have a metal fitting with a button lock. You're going to put that into the machine aluminum inlet. It's going to rotate so it doesn't kink up on you. And then you can use your tools very easily. It'll never tip over on you. And it's also extremely accessible. So very durable inlet. Let's break the unit down a little bit. So you're going to bring the material into the vacuum. There is a float protection in here. We'll show you in just a minute. The vacuum is going to fill up until the desired level, and then you can turn the vacuum pump on. So you can vacuum in pump at the same time if you'd like to at 38 gallons a minute with the onboard uh, return pump that's in here. It runs on low amperage. It's a single power cord, so it's a 30-foot power cord with a three-prong plug, less than 15 amps. It actually runs on 12 amps. So this unit can vacuum and pump 38 gallons a minute, and it runs under 12 amps. To discharge the liquid besides the pump, you do have a convenient two-inch discharge here, and you also have an eight-inch solid discharge that we'll show you as well. That's accessible from the back, and you simply slide this over, and you're going to have full accessibility to empty the solids out the bottom. So as we get into this unit, you'll see the motor deck simply pulls off. You can disconnect your return pump. So now I can take this motor deck and the power cable and the float and everything with me. I can set that down for servicing. And then we get inside the unit. The unit is going to have a stainless steel intake. We have a stainless steel intake that comes down. We have our return pump. It's recessed off the bottom. So when you are have solids in the bottom, they won't go out the pump. And then when you go to empty the solids, you can see that from the inside, that's wide open to discharge your solids. Putting it back together is simple. Close that. Step on the lever. It's now liquid tight. Take your motor deck. And again, you don't even have to disconnect your vacuum hose if you don't want to to service this unit. Now, the nice feature about this is we have unlimited accessories for this machine. Not only can you run an uh, inch and a half hose, but you can also run a two inch hose if you'd like to. And we have a 32 inch floor sweep that conveniently fits to a bracket right on the front of the machine. There's a bracket that goes right here. That will allow you to push this around and capture 32 inches at the same time while you're pushing this around as a mini sleeper. So this is perfect for restoration. This is perfect for floods. Um, we have people that use it for heavier material like slurries as well. So this has been a review of Ruvox wet vacuum.